Welcome back guys. As you can see, my appearance changed a bit, but that's besides the point. The point is that you're getting called dog water by a 12 year old on voice chat whose balls haven't even dropped yet. Now look, I don't blame you for not being good at games. I wasn't the best gamer back in my time. What I was good at was finding cheats. And I'm not gonna lie, things were a lot funner once you're cheating. So today I'm gonna show you guys how to hack games. So the first thing you guys wanna do is open up your web browser and go to cheatengine.org. And on their website in the left menu, you wanna click on downloads and download whatever version is up here. By the way, it gets detected as a virus, so you wanna disable it temporarily for this. Once you have it saved, you wanna run it. And it'll give you the normal setup stuff, but in the beginning here, it's gonna give you these kind of ads. Yeah, you'll see right here. So this isn't actually part of their policy. These are just ads. And if you do accept, it's gonna download, what is this, RAV VPN. And I'm guessing you don't want that, so decline. AVG, I think I'll pass on that, so decline. Just make sure to pay attention on that part because they just you know, sneak in a few things, not sketchy at all. Now, once you click finish, Cheat Engine should open up. And no, I don't need the tutorial, I'm a pro hacker. Now, once you have Cheat Engine open, you wanna run the game that you wanna cheat on. So for my example, I'm gonna be using Assault Cube. Okay, so I'm loaded into Assault Cube, and the first thing that you want to do is select the process. So on Cheat Engine, you want to click on this button right here, and you want to choose the process that's running. So for me, that's Assault Cube. Then click Open. Now how this works is that it scans values on the game until it finds the correct hex address, and then from there, you can edit it and change it to whatever you want. So I'll explain that. So as an example, you can see my ammo is at 20 right now. So I'm going to scan for the value 20. I'm going to type 20, then click on First Scan and a bunch of values popped up. So any of these could be the ammo, we don't know for sure. So we wanna go back to Assault Cube and shoot a few rounds. So right now it's on 16. So now we search for 16 and we type next scan. Now we have less values. So let me shoot some more. Now 13. And if we search for 13, it's only left for two values. Now you can just try both of these out, so. Now to edit the values, you want to click on it and type control E. And let's say I'm just going to change it to 99999. Okay. And as you can see, the value is now changed to 99999. So yeah, it's pretty cool how you can just find the values, change them, and it'll actually work. So like now I literally, like I can give myself unlimited ammo. Now ammo is cool and all, but let's try something a bit more interesting. Okay, so I'm loaded into a game right now. And now I want to try changing the health. So right now I'm at 100 health. So I'm going to... Search for 100 and type a new scan. Click on first scan, gives you a bunch of values again. And now I need to shed some health. So I'm gonna let this guy shoot me for a bit. Okay, now I'm at 84. So I'm gonna search for 84, next scan. Oh, so we got lucky here. It gave us the value right away. So control E, give it some number and press okay. <laughs> and now as you can see, we have a lot of HP. So anyone who tries to shoot us, yeah, it does damage, but we have unlimited health. And now I want to give you guys the biggest cheat code by far. This one's absolutely insane. So you want to open up command prompt. So now you want to type this command and in the quotes, replace the name of the game that you're playing. So I'm going to run this. And now back in the salt cube, whenever I press E, I'm literally going to have crazy God mode. So I pressed E. And now, as you can see, I've like escaped the matrix. I can go behind anyone shoot them, sneak up on anyone, disappear again. After this one, your friends are literally gonna think that you're an anonymous. Anyway guys, that's it for today. Like and sub if you learned something new. Don't forget to join my Discord server and I'll see you guys next time.